Hello! So, I went to make breakfast and discovered that we don't quite have enough bread for toast. Uh, so, I'm gonna cut the loaf. Jen made this yesterday. And it is awesome when we've already, well, there's three slices left. And, well, we're gonna need at least four or five for breakfast. So, I'm gonna cut bread. And I'm going to show you how I've learned to do it because I have learned bread knives are not great for cutting bread. At least not one-handed. Um, now, however, uh, very fresh bread is very difficult to cut without tearing it up my way or without completely compressing it my way. So, I have already used the hone on my knife because I haven't sharpened it lately. So that straightened the edge. So what we need to do is start at the far side. This, this is what I found works good. So yeah, I use a straight bladed knife. This is just a chef's knife. Uh, a cleaver works pretty good too um, for good and cold bread. Uh, so yep. Um, yeah, the serrations just sort of tear and rip at the bread which is not good. So yeah, you want, you want to try and keep it in such a way that the blade is moved sliding across so that it's slicing well. And then, you just keep going. My cutting board's sliding around because it doesn't have any grippies on the bottom. Same cutting board we used yesterday. Still got a few crumbs on it, even. Yeah, this works well with bread that you've put in the fridge. Uh, fresh bread, like I said, just sort of compresses and tears. Um, so yeah, you would need a serrated knife and a very gentle hand to cut that properly. Okay, so I'm at the end. Woo! How are we doing? So I'm at the end now. Uh, and here, let's show you what we got to work with. I can't see. There we go. Yeah, see? that. So it's going to start to want to tip over. So when you get to the end, flip it around, and then cut from this side, because... Well, here, that first, the first slice is pretty tapered. And this one's thicker than the rest because, well, I accounted for the taper. So this way, you can do the same thing, but this way, the, uh, that tapered slice is leaned up against things so it doesn't want to fall over. So the whole thing doesn't fall over on you when you get to, well, right here. There we go. Okay, that's how you cut bread. One-handed. <laughs>